The pandemic has put law school graduates in a bind. Now some Pennsylvania bar applicants are joining a nationwide movement calling on high courts to approve their law license without passing the bar exam. Royce Jones, Royce Jones joins us live tonight to explain. Royce. The 2020 Pennsylvania bar exam was supposed to be administered in July, but because of the pandemic and after being postponed twice, the exam will now be taken online this October, several months after graduation, leaving law school graduates with missed job opportunities and student loan debt. Some say they don't know how they'll pay back. Their careers can be devastated by this. Attorney Michael Engel represents hundreds of Pennsylvania law school graduates in a case going directly to the state Supreme Court. They're filing an unusual petition seeking permanent diploma privilege for 2020 bar applicants in Pennsylvania. It would allow them to practice law in the state without passing the bar. But there should be at the discretion of the court other educational and supervision components for their first year or two of practice. What else are we supposed to do when we have done everything that we possibly can? If approved, qualified law school graduates waiting in limbo like Joseph Stead could finally plan a future. The longer that this is delayed, the longer we're put in financial hardship and the longer the community can't get the access to the legal aid that they need. This push has support from the Pennsylvania Bar Association, which cites concerns over the efficiency of the online bar exam. Those include insufficient test questions, potential hacks, and glitches to the online software that may inaccurately flag people for cheating. This unusual and unprecedented situation called for what is admittedly a rather extreme uh, remedy. A remedy this graduate really needs. Most law students come out with 100,000. I have a little bit more because I had another degree. Law school graduates in Utah, Oregon, Washington, and Louisiana are already practicing the law through this type of uh, diploma privilege. We did reach out to the associate, the administrative offices of Pennsylvania courts, but have not heard back yet. Reporting live on Grant Street, Royce Jones, KDKA News.